Hi, this is Steve from the G Suite Tips team here in the UK, and you can find us online at gsuitetips.com. You can follow us on the Twitter, you can follow us on the G+, and of course there is our YouTube channel. You can follow along there as well. Today's um, tip is a neat little utility called Copy Folder, which allows you to copy a folder in Google Drive. And it actually exists under Tools here on our uh, G Suite Tips website. You may never have seen this, but looking at Tools, there's Copy Folder. I'm going to click through for that and come back to that in a moment. So it allows you, as it says, um, you can copy a folder structure and all the files within it in Google Drive. So I'm going to give you a demo here. I'm going to go to Google Drive. And I've got my drive and a folder called Projects. And you can see Project A, Project B. And I've got a Project Template. So if I just expose that and Project Template, which I've colored in red here, and you can see that I've got um, some different folders, so Design. Uh, within design, I've got assets and templates. If I click into assets, there are some standard assets there. Uh, templates, nothing in that one. Plans, what do I have in there? Construction project plan. Reports, I've got a report. And the site visits, I've got a site visit log. So if you can imagine, this is my standard project template. And for every project, perhaps it's a construction project, uh, is the example I've given. When I want to start the project, it always starts with this uh, this same template and set of files within it. Okay, um, so what I want to do is to replicate this set of um, this set of files. Okay, and folders. So to do that without a tool that I'm going to use is actually quite tricky. You have to do it manually. It would be quite messy and quite long winded. So in order to do this, I'm going to pop over here and again. I'm on gsuitetips.com and then the tools and copy folder. And you can see the URL makes sense there. Run this, I have to click sign in with Google. Okay, and authenticate. You can see it's loading here, it just takes a while to load. Okay, and I've signed in. And now uh, I've run this before, but um, otherwise, when you first run it, you would need to grant access permissions to allow this application. Uh, written by us at gsuitetips.com to access your Google Drive like you would with any third-party product. And we have the concept here of a source folder, a destination folder, and um, and we can also give the new folder a name. So I'm going to click here to browse, and I'm in projects, and I want project template. So select that one and select, and that's the source. Destination folder. I'm going to put it in projects at that level and select. Okay, and it will by default will give it the name of copy of, okay, project template. But I'm going to be working on nothing quite as exciting as project X. Okay, and I can optionally copy the files along with it, which is what I want to do. But if I didn't, if I just wanted the folder structure, it would give me the folders only. But I'm going to say copy files, and then I'm going to hit the preview. And what this does nicely is whilst it counts them up here, it gives me a preview. So it says the source and the destination. It's got six folders and six files. Okay, it talks me through here. If I can scroll, you can see me scrolling the folders and then the files. So I've got a nice simple design here with only six things in, but you can do this with hundreds of things. Um, okay, at this point I can back out and cancel or I can hit go. So let's hit go. And we get this little progress bar, and we can watch this. It's not very exciting, okay? But while it's working, it will tell us how it's getting on. Copying the files now. And then we're done. And we get a done notification here. So truth be told, now let's have a look into projects. And here is Project X now existing. Can see it was just created now and if i just close this one down and look at project x we should see uh, in design and assets i had a few files there they go the nice copies of these and this will copy google formats and um non-google formats okay so these were jpegs and pngs uh where was i looking in plans got my construction project plan and reports and my site visit log are all there so you can obviously have a play with it yourself and, uh, and see how you get on, but really useful for things like this one, this little demo that I've con concocted here. So I could then, you know, back to my projects folder, 
right click on project x click on share i could uh click through to advanced here have a look i could make this available to everyone on the domain okay and i might go on to invite people so let's say that my colleague mark is going to be one of the project managers i could give him um edit access on there had a message new project x folder available and send that through and i could actually do something like change this and make mark the owner of this because he might be the project manager on this project so i'll make him the owner save the changes and then he's free to add other project team members as he likes into uh, his project X. So um, in this case, we had a nice clean template we wanted to copy from, and we use the copy folder um, tool, which is available from gsuitetips.com, and you can click on tools, and then you can go to copy folder. There's another one here called file name editor that maybe I'll show you on another one soon, um, or you can have a play with yourself. And that's it, that's our one for today. So it's copy a folder in Google Drive, um, and Thank you for watching. A reminder that you can find us at gsuitetips.com. You can follow us on Twitter and on Google+, and, of course, subscribe to our YouTube channel to watch all of these videos. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.